Hello and welcome back to Old School RuneScape in 2023. This is the fifth episode of the Iron Man Challenge, and I am in free-to-play still. Um, I may go to membership, but um, more than likely I kind of want to shoot for maybe I can actually earn the gold to purchase free to or pay to play a bond and get it that way. I don't know, but um, I've got plenty to do in the free-to-play mode, so um, I'm continuing on that. I've been looking into trying to get these uh, uh, essences so that I can get... Uh, so I want to start casting spells. You could just do it, and I did test it out, where you cast a wind strike spell, so you'd have your um, your two runes on you. You'd have a, a mind rune and an air rune on you, and you'd point at the creature. I went over there. I'd point at him, and I'd have my book open, and I'd click on that, and then I'd cast it. It, it was not good. <laughs> but I did. I, I said, okay. Well, what? What can help that? There's a... Let's see. In the world map. I went up here. All the way up to Varric. And I took the canoe to there. And I went in there. And I said, right here. This guy. This staff shop in Varric. Sells a staff. A bunch of different staffs. And I chose the air staff. And it was 1,500 gold. Which was a lot. But I, I bought it. And... What that allows you to do is cast repeated, likely. If you have a staff equipped, I think. We haven't done it yet. <laughs> um, and then you'd have, let's say, it's an air staff. Then you'd only need mind runes in your... And they stack uh, up to like 5,000, I think. So you don't have to have all like this. You just go grab a whole bunch. And then you can sit there and just single cast on them. And it auto cast repeatedly until the guy dies. And that's how you'd fight him. So that was what I wanted to do. So... I said, okay, I went and bought that. Then I said, well, how can I get the air runes? Well, if I have an air staff, it doesn't use air runes when you cast. But it still needs mind runes. So I said, okay, how do I do that? So it's rune crafting. So you need rune essence. And there was two places where you could teleport in and get these mine, these rune essences up. And it's pretty easy to do it. But um, the first place I went to was over here in this guy in the wizard tower and I went down in there and it wasn't a good idea because he does teleport you there you can talk to him and it says teleport something like that so I teleported over there and I got a bunch but I said I need to go back and forth so up in Varak I went and got a bunch of these by going to right along the east here see how there's a bank here I'll highlight it and then you go right outside the bank. So you go bank. You go right down in this door. So I went, whoa, whoa, whoa. And I went in here. And I talked to the guy in here, Aubrey, and asked him to teleport me to the Rune Essence Mine, which we unlocked earlier through that quest. And I had my pickaxe on me. And I had it equipped, so I didn't have anything else on me. And you go in there and you click it once. And you just it mines and mines and mines and mines. Fills up. Go back out go back up, you know, take the teleport out, go back in here, put them in the bank. And I just went back and forth, back and forth, and did that a bunch. So I said, okay, cool. And then it said, and then I searched, started researching um, rune crafting, how to turn these into uh, the, the runes. And it said you had to go, the very first, the only for rune crafting, you had to first go right up here to this thing. Oh, no, not that one. <laughs> oh, where was it? Hmm. Let's find out. There's the one we're going to next. It was, where was it? it? Wasn't too bad. Oh, it was this way. I went across. Oh, this is where it was. I went and I walked all the way over here and I went to the air rune and I only did it with one set of, uh, I only brought the one set. You can go back and forth to a bank. I think there's a bank close by to if you want a bunch of them. Maybe that's the closest bank, so you go back and forth. But you have to bring, to get in there, so you go all the way over here. To get in there, you'd need either a, an air tiara, but I'd have to craft that. I don't know how to craft that yet. But it said if you bring a talisman, it'll it'll allow you. And it doesn't use it up either. So I brought an air talisman, 
and 27 of these things, these rune essences, which I mined up. I just wanted to unlock my rune crafting to level two so that I could craft uh, the mind runes, because that's what I really want to turn all these essences into. So I said, okay, how do I do that? So I went over there and you right click on this or click this, the air one on the air altar, and then it teleports you up to this little plateau and you click on these onto the thing and it turned it into the thing into the uh what do you call it air runes and i was set and i said and it turned my uh my skill let's see rune crafting level two if we click that let's get this off the screen now i can craft mind runes and that's what i'm going to do next so in summary i went and got the uh the first thing i went and did i took the canoe up to varak and i said let's go to this this guy and bought the, the staff the air staff for 1500 then i went back in here and started going back and forth back and forth back and forth between this guy teleporting me in to get all these and it actually helped with the mining too so that was nice it was something to do you know i was just watching videos and doing stuff like that and going back and forth easy to do nothing too complicated and then i said well now i need to unlock my level two of rune crafting so i went back down to lumbridge and i used the teleport thing and i went over there and did that and now what we're gonna do is we got to go all the way over here. So, to get there, I want to use this. I don't want to go here for the canoe. I want to go this canoe. Are there more canoes? I could go all the way up there. Maybe that would be better. Hmm. What do you guys think? I, I'll try that one. And then we can just walk across to this. I don't know if that blocks me. What do you think? Uh, I think it's going to block me. Well, I guess we'll give it a try. We'll go that way we'll just see how far i can get that way so i want to go for here i've got the mind rune with me this talisman thing i probably don't need that with me and is there a bank close by to here there's a bank Ugh. oh no are you kidding me maybe i should have got a mind staff is there a mind staff i don't think there is that's a really long ways to go for that's crazy. Hello? That's... But I gotta go back and forth that far? Alright, we'll take a look at it. <laughs> no, come on, is there a bank closer? No, there isn't. Alright, we'll give it a shot. Alright. Um, Close this down. We're gonna go over there. Oh boy. We're gonna go to the canoe tree. And I've got a, uh, a chopper, uh, an axe on me. That seems like a long ways to go for... Maybe I should have bought the... Uh, I'll look into that. Maybe I should have... Because it's easier to get the uh, air runes. Maybe I should have got a mind staff. A uh, dugout? I guess I'll do a dugout because I can go... Oh no, I want to use the, the big one. I've never made one of these before. Because that'll give me three... I can go, oh, I did it. Push it in there. I've never been on this one. One. Normally I could go one up here to this Champions Guild. Then the Barbarian thing. We're going to go all the way up to Edgeville. Wow, so I could actually... So now I've got a basically a teleport to Edgeville. Does it go faster? Well, I know it's better than walking up there. Where does that put us on the map? 30 seconds? No, 30 milliseconds. That's the uh, ping, I think. It's like 30 seconds. Ooh. I don't know what these things are, but I've heard about them now. Let's put our map on the right way. So now... Oh, I can't go over there. So there's no way to get... I've never been up this far. Oh, I didn't want to knock you over. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Oh, that's another canoe. Oh, that's the canoe thing. Is there a way to, to get in right there? I've never been here. I got a peek over there. 
No, there's not. Let's take a look at the map real quick. Yeah, there's no way to... I'd have to go all the way over here like this. Yeah, that's not a good thing. But I don't want to go that way anyways. Stay focused. We're going over this way. So let's... we got our running boots on. Ooh, an iron mace. That'd be nice. Can I just take it? But then I'd have to give up something else. So I'd bend her that... Ooh, is this guy going to attack us? Hello, buddy. You look upset. Can I shoot him? I don't have anything to shoot him with. It'd be nice if I could just stand on this side of the ditch. It's a guard. So that's not... So far... Chop down a tree. So far, to get from here... Wow, so... You know, you think that this is really a long ways from Lumbridge, but it's not. I just, you know... What is it? Shh, a ram? Can I kill him? No. He's just mad at me now. But I can get up here and take... What are these? So I can get a bunch of cabbages that easily just by going on the, the boat. The canoe. It's a sign. Can I go across here? What is this? It, it flashed. Cross... Cross it? Um... If you go any further, you will enter the wilderness. It's very dangerous. The further north you go the more dangerous it becomes. An indicator on the bottom right of the screen will show the current level of danger. I'm not gonna go in there. What is over there? There's probably people hiding behind these bushes just right, waiting to get me. Oh, oh I don't want to go there. I just want to look. I'm not going over there. Is there a way to, like, it'd be nice if you could just hop over and hop up there, but no. Level 33, I've never saw that. Oh, look at that castle. A black knight. Alright, so but let's take a look at the map and see if we're going roughly the right way. We want to get over there. How do you get, like... I don't want to run all the way over here and have, never find a way down. I don't think... I think this is all like a ledge. So let's not do this. Let's go this way. What's that? A quest. Ooh, below Ice Mountain. There's a good quest that we could do. All this area. I've never been over here. Okay. Let's go this way. I don't trust it going up there. But that's not bad to get over here to this dwarven area now that we got our wood cutting up to 42. That's how you unlock the, uh, the canoeing. What are these guys? Ooh, chop down this tree. Can I chop it down? I'm going to drop this. What do I get? Just regular logs. Drop those. No. <laughs> drop the log. Take the rune essence. So you just get regular logs from these trees? I guess so. Let's, ooh, these, those imps are good sometimes, but... I think they're good. A dwarf? I don't want to fight you guys. It just seems weird fighting dwarves. Like if it was said evil dwarf or bad dwarf. Yeah, there's no way. What's that? Talk to Willow. Hello there. What are you doing all the way out here? Nothing you need to worry about. You do not meet all the requirements to start below the out... Oh. Oh, that must be the quest person. I feel like I'm going to get jumped or something by these bad guys. What are these guys? So we want to go right up here. I don't know what this is. What does that say? Talk into drain pipe? <laughs> What's this? Climb over a crumbling wall? Put our speed boots back on. Oh, there's a bear. Oh, God. Run! <laughs> He's a level 19 bear? Ah. What's this guy? Okay. Focus. So I could come here and fight bears, I guess. 
but the idea uh, I really want to get my magic up so that I have more some teleports but I don't it, it's necessarily like a teleport rune or a here we are um not a teleport rune but what is that guy a level five if there's a, a spot with a bunch of level fives and if they have that negative on their defenses that would be good oh he's not bugging me I imagine if I was lower level he would bug me though so maybe you have to watch oh I clicked in the middle here and it's gonna try to find the path in hey, you're not bugging me you know better I guess I don't know what all that is focus okay so what I did was I clicked this and I clicked that and then I'm in here I've never been here that's the way to go out let's walk over here hello oh there's a thing going on these are good oh gosh let's do this first we're gonna click that on that and it turned them into those and now we got rune crafting four now I want to talk to that guy where'd he go oh there he is I want to make sure I had room so you just click on that okay let's do this sure I'd like to explore the maze okay we've done this before I like exploring mazes okay let's do it faster this time uh, hello where's the <laughs> I say let's do it faster and then I can't find the way out the first where's the wall there it is oh they're making us go backwards more Wow, they're making us go way out to the outside. And then this way. And this way. And now I know that there's a timer, too. Open that door. And this door. And then we can go this way. Should I grab that chest? I don't know if it's good to grab chests or not. Let's go grab it. Found some bolts. Probably not a good idea to grab these. We want to get a higher reward. Let's see if I can go faster and get a better... Maybe you don't get a better reward if you go faster. I think we were at 25% or 26% the last time we did one of these. That was a while ago water rune how many I don't know looking for the door yeah last time I didn't know there was a uh, uh oh where's the door I can't go that way is this a dead end is this whole thing a dead end I didn't know there were dead ends Oh, there it is. I assume let's go in here. Go here. Come on. Why is it not let me do it? I don't think that's the right way. It seems like a way. Uh... Well, where's the other door? There's a door here. There. Oh, I'm gonna fail. This is not good. What? Oh, there's a door over here. I don't think I've ever seen a, a room with two doors. There we go. Come on. Come on! I have, my, I have my speed boots on. Or maybe it doesn't take speed speed away. Does it? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't seem to be changing it. Touch it! 43. What'd we get? Hello? We've got some feathers, some mithril ore, and steel arrows. Let's see. We got a bunch of feathers, 236 of them, mithril ore, 
Oh, I, I couldn't get Mithril Ore. Oh, yeah, I could. I, I don't know. No, I don't think I can yet. And some steel arrows, but I can't do arrows yet. So we can go back out of here. We're back to the altar. And... So if I tried to get more essence to come here with this, I think I might have to go buy a... Is there a way to buy a... Uh, what do you call it? Oh, I don't want to move yet. Hold on. What's that? Um, bank. That's the closest bank. That's almost like at the canoe thing. So what? Is there a shortcut across here? Maybe right here? Or this way? Let's go take a look over there. Oh, wait, right here. Oh, gosh. Look at that. I can't take anything. Is there, are pe can you see people over there or not? And can I go up here? Let's cross. Enter the wilderness. I've never been over here. Let's cross over here. It looks, oh, it's getting dark. I don't want to do this. I'm going to turn my walking off so that if I do get near somebody that wants to hurt me. Come on. Help! <laughs> I think this is a bad idea. Can I walk down? Or am I stuck up here now? I think I am. This is bad. Wrong way. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. I don't even know what this is. Oh gosh! I don't know what this is. There's all kinds of stuff here. Let's just cross over here. Maybe this is like the secret way. So I'm just walking. Nothing to see here, guys. Don't. Oh, God. my! I've got my good pick, too. Oh, no. If I get across here, can I just... Run up there. Cross there. Run! I think this is a bad idea. I should only be doing this with, like, maybe not even my armor. Because if they kill me out here, they take everything, don't I, I think. And now I'm safe again? Maybe. <laughs> is there a bank right over here? So that is a faster way to go, but maybe... Where's the bank? Bank, bank, bank. Yeah, it's... It, it seems like the faster way to go. But I can't get across here. It's blocking me. Oh, I walk behind the building. So maybe if I go over there, just go with the Mind Talisman and the Essence Runes and just go back and forth that way. There's the bank. Is that a bank? Yes, it is. So that's not too far. But I'll look into the mind room, because it seems like I can get... Well, we'll take a look at it on the map. Bank. Oh, you guys are going to get to see how much stuff I have. Got so much stuff. Uh, I got 163 of these. I don't need this, so let's uh, deposit everything for now. And then we'll take uh, the mind rune. We'll just take a look at this. So, so far, so good. Oh, we got the, the staff. Let's find out um, if it would be better to have... I don't even know if there is a mind staff. Don't know. I th I don't think there is. I don't know why I think that, but I don't think there is. So, let's see. Here's the air. If I used a mind staff instead, and then used a bank... Yeah, I think that's just a path. So that would be easier if I went that route and just... I don't think there is a mine staff. Otherwise, I would have bought that and just did this. But, but maybe there is. But otherwise, if not, then I run, which isn't too far, and make sure. And what I'll do is I won't. Uh, I'll make sure I don't have anything on me. Ooh, that's a skull. And I'll just run right over here and right over there. It's better than going all the way this way. We'll give it a shot. But, um. I'm going to do that, and then I'll come back, and you guys, uh, I'm going to make a bunch of trips. 
and then I'll have the Mind Rune, and then I'm going to go to Lumbridge and cast our first spell. So you guys get to see that in a second. So I made another uh, trip over there and back. Not bad at all. But I said, you know what? There's a smeltery right here. And I had these iron ore. So I was like, okay, not bad. I'll run in here and smelt these into iron bars. Not bad at all. <laughs> and I think, let's, let's take a look at the map. Yeah, the canoe place is right here. So if I do get iron, what I'll do is if I do, uh, if I go back, uh, I've been getting iron here, put it in the bank, put it in the bank, put it in the bank, and then I could teleport to Lumbridge and take the canoe up there, but then I would need, or just walk over there. Probably just walk over there. I don't think I'd go back there and teleport. I'd just walk over here and smelt it up that way through the bank. Oh well, I thought I was onto something. But if I ever need a smeltery, it's right there. But there's a smeltery down in a... But this is a better smeltery with a bank. That's what it is. If I do a lot of smelting, that's the way to go. So I'll smelt this up, and uh, then I'm going to make a few more trips. For the uh, mind runes. If you guys know, of, is there a mind staff? I'll see you in a bit. I've uh, I've now made quite a few trips back and forth. I realized you can cross anywhere. You don't have to cross right there. And this time I'm taking with me an iron longsword and an iron square shield because I saw a scorpion over here. So I don't, I'm not sure what this means. It doesn't mean that if I'm safe, if I'm standing by the ditch, but not but still on this side, but there's a scorpion somewhere up here. So I've, I've got a couple of spots for stuff that I could get. Maybe I could get it on the way back, but we'll see. Come on, Scorpion. Where are you? Hello, Scorpion. Maybe somebody... Oh, there's a sign. Oh, not what I mean. He's going to be gone now. Ooh, that's a scary guy. Oh, wizards. Where'd the scorpion go? Oh, there's one. Level 14 scorpion. So let's go try to attack him. I've got my uh, run speed at a 100 just in case. Oh, there's skeletons. Could I? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't want to attack. All... I don't know if they all attack me. Oh, gosh. You see? There we go. Just one. Am I going to have any chance at fighting this guy? Oh, yeah. I just wonder, I don't know what they drop. Maybe I could come fight these guys. Seems like a good place right across the, you know. Maybe these are good to fight. Maybe I'll do a test on these guys. Anything? Hello? Hello? Maybe I have to fight those. Oh, I don't want to fight those skeletons. What kind of weapon am I using? A sword. Oh boy. I, I'm living with only those two little pieces of armor, too. How does armor affect your, um... How does armor affect your run thing, too? I know there's weight, but... Does it make this go down faster? Because it seems like I, I'm at 100 a lot more often. So maybe I could just make a junky weapon and just jump over here and... I don't know. Anything? Do I have to fight him too? If there's three of them, they don't drop anything. Look up drops. Right click. Look up drops. They do drop stuff. Not sold, a looting bag. I don't know what that is. One in 20, oh, a one in 10 chance. A one in 25. I'll have to figure out what a looting bag is. A book page. A clue scroll, a 1% chance. A key, 1,400 of them. A slayer enchantment. 
Uh. Oh no, this one. So they don't. It seems like they don't fight a lot of them. Like, like if I'm fighting this one, this one won't fight me. Take that off. That's a nice thing. I can right click and see what they drop. And this is probably enough. I don't want my health to go down. I, I think I'm going to need better defenses in here. Like a base defense. Alright. Anything? No loot bag? Let's book it. Run! Alright, I'm going to run out of here and uh, I'll be right back. What's that yellow thing? See that yellow dot on there? Re you guys can rewind and see if that's a yellow dot. Is that a bad guy? No, that's me. That was weird. Very strange. I don't like it. Click that. Click that. Hop in here. Click this. Click that. Loot bag off to look that up. I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, so that wasn't so bad. I'm not sure if you can withdraw these. Oh, as a bank note and try to do it with those? Or do I just do 27 at a time? Not sure. But um, so far I got them done. Um, I looked into that looting bag, but I really didn't really understand. You can only use it in a wilderness or something. Not sure about that either. But um, equipment wise, I went with my magic gear now. Um, I've been saving up that magic gear down here in this uh, tab by making a tab. I just, you know, you just put stuff on the tabs like, am I out of tabs? New tab? I don't know. Um, so my new gear for for um you can call it that is uh the hat that zombie shirt that i found not sure where i found the training shield i have the staff of of air some leather boots and these things don't you know i tried them on and made sure that they don't because my magic was minus 55 with all that other stuff on the uh, melee armor the metal armor and everything so now i'm plus 12 and we'll see what happens. Let's do the uh, teleport and we'll cast our first spell. Uh, okay. Do this thing. I gotta remember that I can come up here to this canoe spot. Where is the canoe spot? Right there. And then I can just come over here and smelt all I want really easily, fast. Okay, so maybe even better than, you know, uh, going up here normally I'd go up here well I'd sell it too I just run in there and then yeah I don't want to bank this way so nope all right uh, let's go over here we'll put our running shoes on oh boy now I should be able to right oh filters no they said something about like I can just cast it cast it is it gonna keep casting Auto retaliate on spell. Oh boy. Choose spell? Choose spell. What's this? Why is there two? That's weird. Choose spell. I don't understand what this is. Okay, we got. I'll take the water runes. <laughs> Easier than making them. And let's go in here. Can I cast it on the other side of this? Can I go like that? Oh, now he's what? Can he hit us back? Am I getting experience? Zero. Do I only get experience if... Where's my... Uh, let's reset. Oh, I got some. If I get more, even though... Well, I'll have to check. Um, let's cast on that guy. Yeah, I, it looks like you get... I got experience. Ooh, magic level 5. Water strike. I don't know how to cast that one yet. But. Okay, I'm going to wait for like two misses in a row. There's one miss, but it went up. That's a miss. 
it looks like it goes up. And what, does it use a thing every time? 196, let's find out. There's one. 195. 194. Oh boy. How can you, how can we find enough of these things? I know I can get 30 from uh, that lady over there. If you don't have any, she'll give you 30 of each. Or 30 of whichever one you don't, you know. So she can give us 30 of them, but that's not too many, really. But I'll definitely take advantage of it. I should have been doing that, because that's like one full trip back and forth between the, the that altar. That's pretty nice, actually. And we're just going along. I've seen people casting, now I'm one of the people that cast. And... 7,500 EXP. Max hit, how do I make that go up? I only get a max hit of one? That's pretty bad. <laughs> oh, I got a two, so how did I get a two then? A one and a two. Um, maybe there's a different thing here. Choose spell. Oh, I could do a water spell. Let's try one. Oh, let's try that one on that one. Now, is there two different spells? Water spell. I don't know. Let's try a water spell. I think we can cast six of them. One. Two. Three. I don't know what's going on. Do we get more experience? Uh, I'm now level seven. Magic. <laughs> oh, very nice, very nice. I'll take the bones. Yeah, I don't understand this part. Can I just cast that? Do I have enough? I'm hitting him with my spell. What? Oh, because I don't have any uh, things. Did is that giving me magic power or no? <laughs> I'll just hit him with the staff. Let's see. What? What is it doing? Is it giving me anything? Oh, it's giving me attack. That's not good. So let's uh, cast um. Oh, over here. Choose a spell. We're back to the wind strikes. So, um, I've now successfully figured out whatever this is, and I'll just go through these. Maybe I'll go get some, uh, 30 more of those, and then that way the timer gets reset on that lady over here. So if you go talk to that person over there, you get, um, I guess I drop them. I run upstairs and I drop, oh, that's going to be scary to drop that many runes, because I think people can pick them up. I drop them. Maybe I can just drop it at my feet. I'll test that out. I'll be right back. It was scary, but I dropped my runes on the ground, and then I talked to this person and claim magic combat tutor. Wait, wait, wait. That's not not ranged. Wait, this one. No. Where'd they go? Oh, right here. No, right here. <laughs> claim. I work with them to give out However, we have cheeky people to take both. I don't want to do that. So um, I just dropped them at my feet and then said, hey, can I have some? And they gave me 30. So what I'll probably do is I'll go sell those air runes that I have up there. I think they sell for one gold piece up a pop. So I'll get 30 gold from every time I do that. Not bad. And I can come back over here and can I fight that guy now? Oh, that's a long ways away. And what, he has to run all the way over to me? Oh, but then I, I should have clicked that thing and swung again, but not bad. Let's go a little deeper in here. Oh, some water runes. I won't use them this time because I, maybe there's a spell that I can use them for that's better. I don't know. And let's see. Let's find out what happens here. 
Come on. And looks good. And let's take a look at our magic. Magic, 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 magic. This thing. So we get... Let's take a look at our magic after that fight ends. And I think we're in pretty good shape. Now we got a confused thing. Uh, water strike. That This is what cast on me most of the time. Level 1 enchant. A beacon. Fire strike. Bones to bananas. Don't know what that does. Wind bolt. Curse. Blind. Where's the... Ooh, Barak. So this is what I'm going to be shooting for. So I can teleport to Varak. I don't know where that would... And then teleport to Lumbridge. So I can go back and forth. But... The, what does it take? A law rune. I have no idea how to get those runes. Or even a fire rune. I don't, maybe? A fire. Three air. So I'd have my air staff out. And a fire rune and... Or maybe a fire rune... A fire staff. And if I can't find fire runes... We'll figure it out. But that's what I want to go for. Is there another teleport? Ooh, Falador. That is a nice one. 37. Teleport to a house, which I do not have. Camelot. I would like to go there. I've never heard of it. I've heard of it, but I've never been. And then after Plague City. Watchtower. So teleports are going to be good. If I can get them. After Eggers Rouge. Deep Atoll. It's quite a bit. Ooh, this would be a good one, too. I've heard of this place. For favor? I was looking into favor. I don't, can, oh, here's a good question. Can I gain favor at this town? I don't know. There was a reason why I needed it for something, but I, to have favor to do something, but I don't know. Tell a other to Falador? Tell her other to Camelot? So I can teleport other people. Can, can other people teleport me right now? Hmm. Don't know. All right. Well, I'm going to be doing, uh, let's see, a bunch of this. <laughs> and I'll see how I, I can get my uh, magic up. And with that, I think this is a, oh, it's a pretty long episode, probably. I, I don't know how long. And I'm looking like a wizard with a shield, I guess. Well, enjoy it. And I hope to get my magic up and go from there. Have a good one. And uh, thank you guys. Um, there's been quite a few people that have subscribed and it's uh, definitely encouraging me to make more content. So I like that stuff and lots of comments. I read them all and enjoy. <laughs>